In this video, we are looking for the polynomial of minimum degree given two complex and one rational zero. Since the two complex zeros are conjugates, negative 2 plus 3i and negative 2 minus 3i, the minimum degree required will be 3 for the three zeros we are given. Now for every zero c of the polynomial, there exists a factor x minus c in the polynomial factorization, which we find by subtracting c from both sides. That means that our function f of x will equal to a times x minus c1, x minus c2, x minus c3 for the three zeros and a being the leading coefficient. And for the zero x equal to negative one, if we add one to both sides, we will get x plus one as our first factor. And for the zero x equal to negative two plus three i, if we add plus two minus three i to both sides, we will get x plus 2 minus 3i as our second factor. And for the 0, x equals minus 2 minus 3i. If we add plus 2 plus 3i to both sides, we will get the factor x plus 2 plus 3i for our factorization. So the factor form of our polynomial will be f of x equals a, x plus 1 for our first factor, x plus 2 minus 3i for our second factor, x plus 2 plus 3i for our third factor. And to change it to standard form, we have to distribute. To eliminate the i's, we will distribute the complex factors first x plus 2 minus 3i and x plus 2 plus 3i. So when I distribute the x, I get x squared plus 2x plus 3xi. When I distribute the negative 2, I get plus 2x plus 4 plus 6i. And when I distribute the negative 3i, I get negative 3xi, negative 6i, negative 9i squared. Notice that the terms plus 3xi and minus 3xi add to 0, and so do plus 6i minus 6i. In addition, negative 9i squared is negative 9 times negative 1, which is positive 9. And now when I add, I get the product to be x squared plus 4x plus 13, which I have to distribute with x plus 1. And I get, when I distribute the x, x to the third plus 4x squared plus 13x and when I distribute the 1, plus x squared, plus 4x, plus 13. This adds to x to the third, plus 5x squared, plus 17x, plus 13. And that makes the factorization of f of x equal to a times x to the third, plus 5x squared plus 17x plus 13. Now, if the y-intercept is at 39, that means when x is equal to 0, y or f of x is equal to 39. So our equation above is 39 equals a times 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 13 or 39 equals a times 13 
If I divide both sides by 13, I will get a equal to 3, which now means that f of x is equal to 3 times x to the third plus 5x squared plus 17x plus 13. And if I distribute the 3, f of x is equal to 3x to the third plus 15x squared plus 51x plus 39. And this is the standard form of the polynomial function given its zero.